Hey guys, this is the Love Dinosaur. I just want to make a brief little video about uh, sharing, and I call it Be Aware When You Share. <clears throat> this is my garage, by the way, one of my favorite places to hang out. I don't know if there's a thing about guys in the garage, but um, I have a garage, I'm fortunate. And uh, well, that's basil, by the way, dried basil from the summer. Um, Maybe I'll make a little tour of my garage video uh, one day for those who care, which is probably a very small percentage. But anyway, I know there's maybe one or two of you out there. One more, who knows? Okay, <clears throat> this is for those who um, who are sharing, maybe you've been sharing for a while, or maybe you're new to sharing, but still feel a sense of insecurity about, okay, they put something out, uh, you put something out and then you feel like people are disliking it or ignoring it. So what I've found um, when I share online is is this. Uh, you know, I haven't had a whole slew of dislikes, but I've got a number of dislikes on my videos on YouTube. Um, Facebook's kind of protective. It's insular, so you can't actually get dislikes, only likes, or people ignore it. So um, it's a little bit safer, but with YouTube, you get the dislikes, the negative comments, sometimes. So I think everybody who's sharing an important message must face this. And, and maybe even if you don't feel your message is important, if it's genuine and uniquely yours and not really trying to uh, feed into the status quo, um, you're going to get some obstacles. I think it's just the nature of life, um, especially in this current uh, sort of negatively geared society. I, we're changing towards a positively geared society, I sense, but um, it's kind of still in that negative realm. There are a lot of angry people in the world. Um, so look, here's, here's what I've learned, is that, uh, I'm going to switch hands here, um, is this, when you share when I share, I, rec uh, I recommend to myself and now to, to, to you guys who may feel insecure about it, share with people that you know are kind of supportive of you first. If you have like a, a mailing list or if you have, um, you know, just share to your Facebook page or if you have like a group of people on Google P Contacts or Plus that, you know, uh, have shown that they're supportive of you already share with those circles first or share with circles that have you know very supportive atmospheres uh, before you just start sharing en masse like sometimes i would share to general youtube community pages and i feel like it's those places that i got a lot of dislikes i don't know um by far i have a lot more likes and i appreciate that um it helps me to know i'm on the right track but at the same time getting dislikes i can't it's not a bad thing, you know, and if you have a lot of dislikes, you know, you might just be having, you might just be saying something that pisses people off, or you might be saying something that people are not ready to hear, or you might just be promoting it in the wrong place, and you got to find the people who do support your message. Um, <clears throat> I look, I'm definitely not an authority on this, but I have some experience, and it's tough when you get that dislike or the negative comment. But look, you persevere through it, and then you find, oh, there are actually a lot, a lot of people who do appreciate what I do. So my message, be aware when you share, is not at all to be afraid of sharing, no. But just to be aware that there are some places that are uh, perhaps wiser to share in the beginning, especially if, if you're finding your feet not so secure about getting you know, support. Go to those places that are more supportive certain communities, uh, your friends, <clears throat> and the people that you know are supportive of you, share with them first, and then maybe when you get a little more bold, you share with the larger en masse uh, crowds. Or maybe you never do, and just allow YouTube search engine to do its work, and they'll discover you if they're ready for you, you know, if they chance upon you. Yeah, I'm a very unique guy, so um, I find when people know me, you know, they tend to be very supportive 
they might offer constructive criticism if they're if they really feel passionate about something that I did if they see that I could benefit by changing it in some way but generally people I know are always supportive of me um, or they just ignore it which is good too but uh, people that don't know me will dislike something because they really maybe don't trust where I'm coming from they maybe think I'm trying to get one over on them or sell something or just trying to show up. I don't know who knows but I find that if, if people do know me then they get it they get where I'm coming from and this must be the same for you I'm sure that people who truly know your heart and your character will be more supportive than those who have no idea who you are so if you can share with those people first it'll probably be to your benefit um, so just be aware when you share have no fear and then you know maybe you can get also get like this this like sort of green ponytail thing in the back of your head uh, if if you like what you see you like it like my green ponytail <laughs> like a mullet okay have a great day take care